It's episode three of the Padres season ticket series. Today is going to be a fun one because we have early access inside Petco Park for the members only batting practice. Unfortunately, the Padres canceled their batting practice at the last minute. Sarah and I still showed up three hours before the game to watch the Padres warm up, run defensive drills, and take ground balls. But the highlight of our pregame experience was watching the Brewers take batting practice from the outfield. The Brew Crew put on quite the show. We saw BP home runs hit by Willie Adamas, Brian Anderson, William Contreras, Rowdy Telez, but it was Christian Yelich that turned batting practice into a full send home run derby. This turned out to be a bad omen for the Padres. Michael Waka's pitches must have looked too much like batting practice because the Brewers offense went off from the very start. Christian Yelich is the first batter of the game. Line to left, a fair ball headed to the left field corner and Yelich is headed to second base. That's a leadoff double for Christian Yelich. Swing into the first pitch, sends one towards the gap in right center field. Cut off by a Zokar, but Yelich is coming around to score the game's first run. Jeez. Two batters, two doubles, a run for the Brewers. Line to left, and this is trouble. Quickly back to the track and the wall. Round comes Adamas with the second Brewers run. It's the third double of this first inning. And a broken bat, base hit into right field. Around from second comes Anderson. The throw is offline, and that is run number three for the Brewers on top 3-0. Not a good start for Michael Walker and the Padres. And a sharply hit ball, a fair ball down the left field line to the corner. Void is motoring around. They're going to try and score him all the way from first base. As a Padres fan, that inning was painful to watch, but I've got to be honest with you, I can't sugarcoat it. It's only going to get worse from here. This is why you never cancel batting practice. Let the big dog eat! Honey. Christian Yelich comes up to bat again in the top of the second inning. Drives this one to right, and that ball is gone. His second of the year, and it's a 5-0 Brewers lead. The Padres' first hit of the game doesn't come until the third inning with two outs. Jose Azokar turns on an inside cutter. Line to left, and there's a base hit for Azokar. It's going to be a double. That's a double for Jose Azokar. Xander Bogarts is up next, but he strikes out swinging to end the inning, and the Padres get nothing. Uh. Brutal. 5-0. Moving on to the fifth inning, and the Brewers just keep pouring it on. Michael Waka hangs a curveball, and Rowdy Telez absolutely crushes it. This one to right field and deep. It is back, and it is gone. Rowdy Telez homered last night. He is homered tonight. Six zero. 6-0. Putting on the cheese head. Waka is coming out of the game, and Bill Chrismont will replace him in relief. He gets the Padres out of the inning with bases loaded, but the Brewers have added two more runs to their lead. Right, well, out of the bases loaded jam, but it is seven to zero. Austin Nola has the night off, so Luis Campusano is behind the plate and hitting sixth in the lineup. He leads off the fifth inning for the Padres. Let's see if he can light a spark and get some offense going for the home team. Driven to left field for Luis Campusano, home run. First home run of the year for Campusano. Something. We'll take it, 7-1. The Padres are finally on the board, but it's just not going to be enough to catch up with the Brewers tonight. It got so bad that Brandon Dixon pitched in the ninth inning. Somehow he was the Padres' most effective pitcher of the game. He retired three batters in just seven pitches and gave up zero runs. We would usually stay until the bitter end, maybe even upgrade our seats for the last inning, but we were so exhausted and completely over this game, so we decided to leave early. And can you really blame us? Padres lost big. It was really bad. We left early, which we don't normally do. Sarah, thoughts on the, the game? Terrible game. <laughs> 
We also went to batting practice and we were there three hours early and they canceled on us as well. Shake my head. Not a good game. Third game we've gone to with our season tickets and we've lost. So sad. We're bad luck. We're over three right now. We've been to three games already. The Padres are under 500. I think they've played like 12, 13 games and we've seen three of the losses. That's pretty sad, but uh, hopefully it turns around for us. We're shooting to go to 20 games this season. Hopefully it turns around. We'll see you on the next one.